We started the Center for Climate and Life because climate is changing faster than our ability to comprehend the impacts of those changes on human society and sustainability. The whole idea of the Center is to mobilize our scientists to understand how climate impacts the things that really matter to people, their access to food, to water, to shelter, and to come up with sustainable energy solutions. At Columbia, we're in a unique position to lead this because we have the Lamont Doherty Earth Observatory in Palisades, New York, one of the world's largest earth science research institutes. And we have over a hundred incredibly distinguished scientists who work on aspects of climate and life science as it applies to sustainability questions. We have a location in New York City that gives us access to the business and finance leaders in the world that will allow us to use this information to bring on real change. What's unique about the center is that this is not business as usual science. We're building partnerships with stakeholders because they're going to be the agents of change. We will be providing the knowledge, the scientific knowledge that's needed to frame the problems, but the way that gets transferred into action really is its injection into the private sector. The real advantage of the Center for Climate and Life is that we have a large team of research scientists who can focus their talents to understand how climate impacts the things that really matter to people. Our goal is to really accelerate that knowledge generation so that we can make wise decisions in the years ahead and create a better future for our children. <laughs>